Hello everybody, I'm back as I promised I'm doing this video to show you guys how to install a custom ROM on your HTC Sensation 4G. Uh, good news, we've got two ROMs available. There's one, one ROM is actually is going to be 2.3.4. 2.3.3.4, another one is going to be 2.3.3 but the difference is going to be the one that's 2.3.3 it's going to be uh, your Sensation 4G on steroids because the developers have overclocked the, uh, the uh, processor to 1.5. Uh, it's personal choice which one you want. I really like the one that's the overclocked one uh, because it's it makes this phone super fast, blazing fast. And a couple of good things about uh, the new features that they have done is look at that TV effect. Okay, and there's the battery widget actually shows percentage instead of just uh, the icon, and you, you you have no clue how much is left. And also, um, let me focus properly. Check this out. Look at this. Look how fast this is. Like, I thought it was going to be really fast, but it's, this is beyond my expectation. This is too fast. This is blazing. There's actually no lag on this. Um, one of the other exciting features is Google Talk. Look at that icon right there. Look at this icon right here. My buddy has, that's actually me. <laughs> okay, that's me, my another account uh, for test. It's calling video. It's doing video call right now. I'm not gonna do that. I want this video to be really short. Just so you guys know, there's video chat and it's really nice quality. Uh, there's lots of other stuff which I'm going to do another video if you guys uh, need to know anything else about this I'm going to do a lot of customization on this phone. I just finished uh, doing the installation So let's get to it uh, now pay close attention. You, you need to do these things You have to go to a website which I'm going to provide in the description You got to download the file and put it in your SD card Which I'm going to show you guys how to do it in a minute after you do that you have to go here Go to the same thing go to settings power turn fast boot off Turn it off here otherwise you won't be able to go to clockwork mod back back so make sure you you plug your USB and copy the file the file is gonna be right here I'm gonna show put so as I mentioned there's two ROMs one is 2.3.3 which is gonna be uh, the overclocked version and one's the 2.3.4 which is the latest Android version so you can read about it yourself the fixes that they have done it's really awesome features I'm not gonna do the explaining so you pick for yourself if you wanna go for the updated one the latest latest Android 2.3.4 you click this one when you go to the website the first one the very first one uh, if not if you want the ROM that I like you wanna install you can go all the way down to pyramid 1.0.9 this is the one so you click this link boom it started downloading now I'm not gonna do that once it's done download I'm gonna cancel it once it's done you go and copy this file to your SD card okay so we're all done with that now we jump back to the phone okay what you need to do turn off your phone <laughs> oh there's one more little feature I want to show you guys while I'm doing this look at this look at that menu you've got all these stuff um, so power off there's a lot of new features you're gonna see in this phone in this ROM and the 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 the, mo the, the best one is the actual speed of the ROM which I love it's awesome speed now you're gonna hold volume down and we'll press power the volume there you go you're in recovery now these are very important so don't miss these steps up okay pay attention now you will go to the second one which is recovery having focusing problems here recovery and you'll press power which means go to recovery clockwork mod now we're going to clockwork mod for those of you who want to keep your data which I don't recommend you need to you know it's the new ROM you don't want to mess it up so uh, you can do a backup you can back up your stuff from here click backup but you shouldn't do that go to wipe data 
factory reset. So whatever you have, you know, uh, you should know by now when you're doing this that what a factory wipe means. So you gotta do a factory wipe, reset, reset your phone. Um, do it twice. I'm not gonna do it on my phone because I've already done it. And then you're gonna do wipe cache. When you're done with the factory, you come back here in the main menu and you're gonna do wipe cache. When you do wipe cache, then you go to advanced right there and you will go to wipe down the cache the second one click that when you're done go back to main menu okay so you're back in the main menu you will go to apply sorry install zip from SD card boom click so from this menu you're gonna go to to the first one from this menu you're gonna go to the first one you're gonna click choose zip from SD card click that and now to the whatever folder you saved that file you find it from here so I click uh, save it here zips click on it just scroll and find it it's gonna be insert coin 1.0.9 and click on it and it's gonna start doing the stuff so be very patient and wait for it I'm not gonna do it because I've already done it uh, go back when everything's done you do a simple reboot okay so reboot your phone and you're all done I'll do another video on the features and everything if you have any questions uh, just play with it play with the ROM like I said it's uh, you're gonna feel like your sensations actually on steroids uh, very good battery life and any other questions please leave me a comment and don't forget to subscribe if you need more help on the sensation